Hey Vogue, I'm Dua Lipa, and this is what's in my bag. Good to go? Okay. Car keys, very important. Especially when I'm home, I love to, to drive everywhere. I have my diary, which the outside is all really cute, but the inside is just like a notebook that's like falling apart and lots of Polaroids from Tor, my choreographer's assistant. This is me and my band as we were doing Tiny Desk. I feel like I'm on tour all the time, but I love it. I have so much fun performing and I feel like a lot of the stuff that's in my bag, I just collect throughout my travels. Like I have, oh, it's like a little good luck duck. Iron on patches, Don's Depot in Austin. Stickers, you're on the Rock and Roll Hall of Fame. Matches, hot sauce, very important. Always carry hot sauce with me because I feel like it makes every meal better. I have books. I carry like two in my handbag and then I have more in the suitcase, especially if I'm gone for a long period of time. This one is Hernan Diaz, In the Distance. This was actually a gift from Hernan. He came to see my show and then I guess this just came out in hardback. So he gave me this one, which I'm really looking forward to reading. Selva Almada, Not a River. This has been in my reading pile for a little while and I'm really looking forward to getting into this. It's a Latin American author, an Argentinian author actually. This publisher, Charco Press, they translate a lot of Latin American authors, contemporary Latin American authors. And so I'm always really interested in what they've got. And this is one that I'm looking forward to reading. I get a lot of recommendations. My friends send me books. I do the book club, one, because I just love reading books. Like I wanted to share the experience with lots of people. I started my company called Service 95, which I've thought of as like an online cultural concierge where we have lots of different stories from around the world. There's no kind of method to the book club. It's just books that I've read, that I love, that I choose for the month. And we just see if the authors wanna join us for a conversation. What else? I've got my laptop, which has some stickers on it. My Spanish book. When I'm away, I like to learn languages. I have a teacher who I speak to on Zoom. And so my laptop and my GCSE higher Spanish is with me. Notebooks for French and Spanish. I think I'm gonna stick to French and Spanish and try and get good at those first. And then if I can do it, then maybe Italian as well. But I speak Albanian fluently. Hey Vogue, when you're doing Lipa, and Okay, some life essentials for when I'm traveling, which are really important. My eye mask. Band-Aids, throat pastels. Oh, electrolytes. I love these ones. I take them every day. Oh, these $2, actually. These are like good luck. There's a guy called $2 Steve that comes to every good show. And he's like in the, in the backstage and he just gives out these $2. And actually I'm supposed to pass it on, so you should have one. There you go. Under eye patches, Augustus Bader. I can't live without them. This is super important, especially with all my travels, when I'm on a plane, I pop these on and I'm like, okay, maybe I'll wake up looking a little bit more refreshed. I've got Manuka honey drops, just throat stuff. That'll make me feel good on a flight. My face cream, headphones, multiple headphones. I have so many headphones because I probably, I pick one pair up and I put them in my bag and then I take another pair and I put them in my bag and then it's quite handy actually because when I need to make phone calls, <laughs> they're quite tangled. But if one's tangled, then I have another pair that's less tangled. It's handy to me. I like wired headphones because I don't have to charge them. It's just one less thing to charge. I feel like there's just cables everywhere and there's cables everywhere, but in a different, in a different way. My wallet. Nothing to say about that. Sunglasses, sunglasses. I think this is probably like the headphone situation. It's like take one pair off and then leave the house and then put another pair on and I forget, so I accumulate. This is actually probably the least amount of sunglasses I've had at one time in my bag. But they're different, different for different outfits. And also if my mood changes throughout the day and I go, actually, I want to like spice it up with a different sunny, I've got that. My passport, always with me, because you never know. Oh, favorite place I've been recently, Austin. Texas. I went for the first time in 2016. I did South by Southwest 
and I hadn't been back since then. And so it was just, it's amazing. I love how vibrant the city is. It feels so alive. The people are really nice. The food's really good. I loved going dancing at the honky tonks, uh, all of it. Really, really fun. This is Minnie. She has a name. I use this for everything. It's a little janky, but it's great. It takes really good pictures. This is like the perfect party companion. Oh yeah, this important uh, SD card straight to my phone so I can get the pictures immediately. Because although I've got patience written on my hand, not that patient. I like things done really fast. Yuzu matcha. I like to have a lot of like condiments, electrolytes, sweets, matcha that I got in Japan that I love. You never know when you're gonna need a little boost of energy. It's getting quite busy here. For a khaki, this is herbs and nori and stuff, but again, or like, like if there's only like rice, you can make it really fun. This uh, chili flakes, also very important. Tarot cards. I love to pull out a card every day. Sometimes if I feel like I want to make a decision, I'll pull one out and see what it what it tells me. Yeah, I'll pull one out now. Let's see. Watch it be something insanely terrible. <laughs> Not sure what kind of energy I just put into it. It says the flute. Connection to spirit, understanding and education, ritual and celebration. Life is magical. We'll leave it at that. Let's not do more. Okay, I'll put those there. Compression socks. Flying, they're always at, there's always something at the bottom of my bag. It's good to have. What else do I have in here? Some trail mix. Just a lot of snacks, it seems. Glass protector. It's for the phone, but it's also got like a privacy screen on it as well. So it's like, make sure that I'm not gonna smash my phone, but also just feel safe. My phone. My love shine. I love this. I actually needed some of that. God, there's so much random stuff. Like pens, hairbands, more vocal jellies for my throat. Singing straws. But I can tell you, as I've never used them. <laughs> but they're in my bag in case I need them. But you're basically supposed to like blow into it and try and hit this is how you like warm up your vocals i much prefer going up scales and warming up like that but these are supposed to be quite good so if anyone wants to try them you're welcome and these are my charms that i've collected these i've collected in temples in japan and in india and this was a gift from my friend ray on my birthday what does my bag say about my life very deep um chaotic it's fun and there's a lot of flavor I know that no matter what, I'm covered. Thanks for watching. That was what was in my bag. <laughs>